Hello there, I'm Tim and he's John and this is How to Murder Blocks, a Minecraft adventure. Hello everybody. Watcher. We're back uh, here again. We're regular always back viewers, here. <laughs> regular viewers may find this somewhat familiar. Uh, we've done a lot of enchanting this time. I've now got the full set of protection for gear. Uh, my sword is super sharp and does about twice as much damage now. Also, we've got flasks of shielding, which give the absorption effect, which I've now learned actually gives you an additional health bar, which gets replenished if you remember to re-drink the potion. So. And of course, there's the uh, vast number of healing potions I've got in stock. Um, and I've got my super bonuses from our previous warm-up bout. Uh, 20 minutes of that still going. So, do you really want to be stood here? No! <laughs> so, uncharacteristically proactive of you. Okay, here we go then. I want to be stood here. Yeah, it's not the place to be. So, um, piece of coal. Right. Mask of shielding up. What's the worst what that can happen? What is the worst that can happen? I'm going to summon number two. Here he is. Right. So I'm a bit more durable this time, um, but it's still going to be quite fraught, I suspect. Now he is, he is sort of chain spamming me with pixies, but I think that just triggers pixies of my own, so that might be helpful. Oh, he's going down a lot quicker this time. You reckon? Am I actually? Yeah, you are. Okay. But I still have to keep an eye, because even with all this healing, I think the wither still could wait completely decimate me if I spend too long in the pink smoke. Because I've got lots of regen on the go, but I need to have time not being attacked for the regen to kick in, as it were. Oh, I've lost my barrier shield. Oh, yeah, no yeah, there it goes. Fresh set hearts. So we're off again. Right. He's gone the offensive. Hitting more than he hits you. Yes, that's the plan. Where is he? So we think the buff to the sword that we've done, the sword enchantment, that only works on actual melee hits and not the laser beam effect, so... God, he's, he's all over the place. You're nearly down to a quarter gone. Yeah, a lot of this is the reflective, because he's spamming me with these missile attack now, which he doesn't do in the first version. I, my pixie armour is reflecting a lot of that back, so he's actually hurting himself more by firing so often, which is pleasing. And you last time we had a crack at this, he did one hit me from you know, about 70% health, so I'm trying to avoid whatever that was. I'm hoping that was just some glitch or special attack I need to learn, but uh, uh, MMO boss fights. Here we go. Yeah, I see you. Oh, those pixies are quite fierce. Ah! Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Drugstore cowboy on the case now. But, yeah. If in doubt, drink more potions. Sound device that applies to quite a lot of fantasy type games. Where is he? Presumably we're going to get a boss wave, uh, mob wave at some point, isn't it? Probably. It is dark, by the way. Oh, yes. Oh, it doesn't matter. My sword does tend to one hit normal vanilla mobs now. Which is, again, pleasing. He's almost at half. You know, I think the pixies are doing more work than I am here. I have to arrange to have a party for them or something afterwards. I don't even, I mean, I'm just taking it for granted that this pixie thing's even real. I can't see it happening. Does it look like I'm firing anything back at him from the outside? Uh, not really. <laughs> Fair enough. Yes! A whole new health bar all of a sudden. Christ! Yeah! I think I'm taking the smoke actually, I might just start charging it. Still, it's nice to not be in the smoke momentarily. Uh, flail crazily! How many weeks I've been planning this revenge? Quite a lot. Yep. It's like an Enderman on steroids. Nearly down to a quarter. Thanks, coach. You I can, can do, do it. it. I'm Keep a winner. Mm. Is he gone? He keeps teleporting behind me. Yeah, when in doubt, he's behind you. Oh, hang on. 
or yellow. Oh, running low on yellow. I'm not getting through the yellow nearly as fast as I was getting through the pink ones, so I think this is a winning strategy. I just need to go the distance. God, there's a missile spam. This chap's a Kaldari, clearly. Oh, he's gone into the sky. Okay. Oh, lots Hang of on. stuff going into him. Monsters! I oh, don't worry about that. <laughs> Commence the reaping! Oh, more witches this time. Kill more monsters. Oh, I'm getting dizzy. I don't know about the viewer. There's a skeleton behind you. Keeping on that health bar, shall when it's... Oh, here it comes. Yeah, it looks back to normal. Oh, I've got some witch poison on me. Is that going to temper the effect? Oh, well. <laughs> Look at all that loot. I think we are sorted for arrows. Oddly, I think they grow on trees. Well, if not, we've probably got an automated process that can turn them out by the million. Um, problem is he's firing at me so fast that my pixies are hitting him so fast that he's gone constantly teleport crazy. Uh, just wait about actually, then. Well, yeah, I suppose, but I'd like to be able to get in there and wallop him with the sword, because that's the bit that does the actual damage and makes this thing be over soon. It's nearly over. I'm fading fast. I'm not as young as I used to be. Can't do that's this for two hours solid. Yay! Oh, I heard a bang. Oh, we did it. Ninja loot. Are you going to steal all that loot? Actually, I've got an inventory space. It's full of potions. What we got? There's a dice. Yeah, we're off so, that. So the dice of Loki or something or other. 16 guy spirits that time. So I still think... Oh, and a music disc. I think it's probably still more efficient to... Do the, north, the level one guardian if you're just after uh, 26 mana steel. What are the wills for? What are the where? Wills. Oh, I don't know. Mana, diamonds, dice. God, I've got too much stuff. Yeah, hopefully you've grabbed some of it as well. So we got, will of, we got shift. the will of Arim. Oh, this dice is bind or pick up, is it? Soul bound to Van Hemlock. Ah -ha. Uh, mm. I can't see because there's too many buff things. Anyway, I think we've done well there. I'm pleased. Oh, it's compounder. Okay, so if we look at the end of this quest, which we can claim a reward. Oh, there was a quest or something, wasn't there? Uh, I need to get to an A system. I've got too much stuff. I can put my flying uh, flying thing back on now. Yes, I am a mighty pink fairy god. Tremble, mortals. Yeah, it probably isn't even my final form. I'm saying nothing. Mm. Right, let's go to the AE system and dump all this stuff and uh, work out what that is. I hope, and I'm I'm probably misguided in this hope that we have finished the Britannia page now because that was the last thing remaining. I think we may have finished Britannia. We'll find out in a second. God, I can't cope with anything more powerful than that. But yes, enchantment and a massive amount of potions seems to be the thing. Uh, to be fair, it does seem like Britannia provides all the tools you need to fight the big end of Britannia boss. So, you know, most of the stuff we were using there was Britannia stuff, mostly because it turns off all the other stuff. You turned oh. up and killed the A system. Hello! Oh, it's gone. Let's give it a kick. Was that it? Oh, sorry, I... Probably shouldn't be shooting you. If I right click with something that isn't the sword, I might do it. There we go. There's a terminal out here that I can use without hurting you. <laughs> uh, music disc. Chuck that back in there. So what's that? Dice of Fate. Relic. Soulbound of Van Hemlock. He deals the cards to find the answer. The sacred geology of chance. The hidden laws of a probable outcome. The numbers lead a dance. Mm. Profound.
hound. Little bit pretentious. Anyway, I got a will of Torek because it was like Torek. Ah, celebrity, right. Um, but more importantly, what's that due to a quest book? Another completed page. Broad green cart canister pick will of Torag. <laughs> I tended to get that one too, but uh, we probably ought to diversify. I'm going to get the will of Cariel. I've no idea what that does. Splendid. Oh, the Guardian dropped one of these things as well. Yeah, it's in the system now. Okay, you chuck that in there as well. Same thing we do with everything. Chuck it in until we work out its force. The green canister. Oh, I got. No, I'm already, I'm already packing one of those, I think. Okay, well, in the system then. Have you got a green canister? You, know, you probably have now. Yes, I shall equip it as well. Wow, well, look at that. I now start, have two green canisters right, on. Started back there with runes and seeds. and There we go, all the way to the end. We have now I'm taking finished. your one because you don't know you can stack them. It didn't seem to stack. Or do you stack them in inventory first? And, oh, whatever. I don't need that. I've got like all sorts of runic stuff and about a million potions. It's true, don't. actually. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Given given what given how it's all played out so far, it's you that needs the extra health, isn't it? Okay, let's chuck some of that away. Get my big stick with the knob on the end back out. Guy spirits back in there. We can upgrade some of our mana spreaders with those. That's quite good. I might have tried some of those luminizer things as well, which I think is a kind of point to point teleporty thing for Batonia. And there's a Corporea network as well, which is like its own AE system, which um, you know just to really <laughs> confuse the hell out of everyone. Anyway, so that's the way the world works. Finished. Huzzah! We have nothing more to, to do with Britannia. Apart from its inherent utility, of course. Uh, what the world teaches still needs looking at. We've got a locked quest there. And probably looking at the percentages involved, there's probably a whole load more un undiscovered hexagons as well. What else we got? Uh, how the world grows. Oh, it's your witchcraft. I think you're letting the side down. Yeah, I think I'll do some witchcraft next. Well, we've got the thorncraft thing. We've got to go in the labyrinth and try and find pearls and things at some point as well to get to the end of thorncraft, I think it looks like, percentage-wise. Let's do some witchcraft. There's a couple of bits of witchcraft we can do for the rest of the episode. Okay. So you've got two witchcraft pages, which seems unfair. Seems annoying. Yeah. The, how the world grows, um, and you look like you need to be doing Parliament presiding, uh, hop along, so something to do with frogs. Uh, well, you, yeah, you spawn ocelot and a critter snare slime. Uh, and then spawn wolf and critter snare bat. There's a thing with a twig over on the far side, you'll need mystic ungent for there. Work on that now. Okay. Then back on your other page, which I think is how the world changes. Oh, lots to do there. Cats and gems and mirrors and dark desires. You still, managed, still haven't managed to work out how to sacrifice that chicken, then, have you? Not yet. Mm. You got the... Ah, I know what your problem is. Using the bowline, sacrifice a chicken over the skull by the light of the moon. I did that. You... Is it the right sort of moon? Maybe it has to be a full moon or... Good point. Sounds like we need to build a massive new facility on the moon. Let's go to the moon. I'm going to build a rocket. Can we build rockets? Kerbal Minecraft program. Life's full of disappointments. We've still got some How the World Enhances to do, which is your super grade machinery stuff. We're going to need their fusion yeah, I need fuel. To, I need to figure that out still. Oh, is, that, is that some sort of massive nuclear reactor? Because we've still got that enormous battery we built in the basement. And then yeah, it's a about. fusion reactor of types. <sighs> Sounds like the best thing ever. What's this dice do? Whoa! Ah! The dice lands on a four. You notice it transforms into something else. Uh -oh. Step layered. I just. It turned into a ring of Thor. <laughs> is it still a dice or is it now the, the ring of Thor? The, the, the dice is gone. I think the dice is a kind of random lockbox. Oh. oh. Oh, no. No, it's a. No, what? Oh, no, that's just me swapping it in and out of my slot. So, what does the ring of Thor do? It makes you worthy enough to carry a hammer. I'm Thor! That's awesome. I'm going to work out what that's for later. Okay, so each time we kill the Gaia Guardian, he'll drop one of those and it 
has a chance, or six, six chances presumably, of turning into six different things. Guess you've got to catch them all. I'm not doing that five more times. That was so tiring. You can do the next one. Yeah, but we, you're all equipped now. I'll let you borrow my armour. I need to enchant your armour, actually. Put all the protection gear on your That's true. habitual suit of mega power terror armour that you never actually need. <laughs> I don't know. Leonard gave us both a pasting. Ready for him when he comes back. He really you. did. No, and, not, because we still didn't work out his gimmick mechanic. Anyway, while hmm. we're waiting for this distillery, I've noticed something. Yeah. You know how we've made this world look like it's all nice and happy? Yeah. I it, think I'm quite proud of it. It's all green. Hmm. But if we dig one down, yeah, it's cracked sand still. It's uh, yeah, it's basically cladding. It's, it's like illusion. a metaphor for life nowadays. <laughs> it's 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 an illu it's the illusion of a world restored. But no, it's basically just a, a lot of botch job on a superficial level. Yeah. When I get on Radio Four, that's my thought for the day. <laughs> uh -huh. Thank you for that. It's very profound. So what are we doing here? What are you making? I am making. Or trying to make a uh, mystic ungent. Okay. Uh, mystic. There it is. Oh, you only need redstone soup. Rowan sapling potion of strength eight minutes. Oh, did we not automate some of these potions? I, I, we, I don't think we did the relevant show and tell, but I think there might be. Even with my done, but uh, there is a whole load of automatic potion brewing stands in the main building now, which is all very clever import export buses and the like so some of that stuff ought to be i think this potion strength eight minutes should be a, an, an available one not sure creeper heart diamond demonic blood what should you get from i've just done the demonic blood distilling demon hearts and diamond vapors yeah oh and refined evil too it's all going Redstone well soup Mm -hmm. I'll play with my ring of Thor. Creeper heart. I've no idea what ring of Thor does. Maybe the Thorncraft book tell me. Petunio book, whatever. I think there should be a couple of creeper hearts in the system. I think you might be able to yeah, make them. We can make them, yeah. Ender artifacts? No. Balls and accessories. Mm, nope. Time to search. Uh, four. No, book doesn't say. Maybe I have to go on a journey of self discovery or something. I'll wear it and see what happens. Okay. Wait, the engine. Okay, detection task. Your next task is to make a mystic branch. Finally, prepare a small and medium circle of the white ritual chalk and drop the twig and ungent into the circle. As long as there is 3,000 power in a nearby altar, you can activate the right, applying the ungent to the twig, creating a mystic branch. This ritual can only be performed at night. <laughs> it's the sun. Uh, do we have an ink twig? It's down as 100% detection, so we had one at some point, but... Uh... Yeah, we got loads, because we keep on disturbing Oh, yeah, every, every time we take an axe to a rowan tree, yeah. we get assaulted by a molesting tree. Okay, could you sort out the circle, please? Uh, yeah. White ritual chalk, small and medium circle. That's not very specific. Which one's this small and medium? Medium must be this ring here. All right. Find some chalk. Sun is setting. Oh no, I'm, I'm, I'm going, I'm going. Yeah. Right, I'm guessing a medium circle is the next ring out then. It's... And the red wash, one's the large, wash. I guess. Yeah, I don't think it does any harm to leave the red one there, does it? We'll find out. <laughs> Which science? It's 
smaller medium are not scientific terms. We want numbers, radiuses, diameters, circumferences. Well, I reckon that's it. Looks kind of smaller medium to me. Yeah. And circular. So, yeah, just chuck them in and use your, use your symbol in the middle, I guess. It will take night, right? Yes, night time. So, um, fought any good guy guardians lately? No, it seems like a boring fight to me. <laughs> oh, you're too cool for that. Yes, yes, of course. Of course, when it came up from behind the mountain, it's not quite so close to sunset. Mm. Oh, do you want some arcane lanterns around here? To... Got a couple in my bag. That's not a bad idea, actually, because I do get a bit zombified occasionally. Yeah, yeah. You being a delicate flower who's no good at fighting anything. Um, let's see. There's one here. Boop. I can hit you on the head with a dream catcher. <laughs> I do like the arcane lens because they auto light up an area around themselves. It takes a takes a minute or two to settle. Okay, uh, should light up all sorts of places in this forest. Because when I was building this forest, I thought, I'll leave it all dark and creepy because of the ambience, you know, because, you know, witches and stuff. Um, but it just turns out you keep getting attacked all the time. <laughs> Maybe I should have put some torches in. Okay. Oh, 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 how sane am I? Oh, about 45% sane? Hmm. Not sure at what point I need to worry about becoming sane again. I would leave, 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 I've been keeping my personal evil going, but uh, I figured I might need it at some point. Don't you ever worry about being sane? Well, I remember sanity. It was quite unremarkable. Do you night's enough? Looks like night to me. So check that, check that, use the... Pop, pop. Boink. Well, that's one of the least impressive rituals you've done on this altar. Really is. Nothing horrible came out or anything. Got potion and regeneration there. Yeah, right, so that's... Uh... Oh, yeah. Claim reward. That seems like a, a pre-task to me. You've probably got to use that stick for something next. Unlocks two quests elsewhere. Oh, yeah, there you go. Ooh, Ooh. Is that a book? book? Yeah, look. Book quests. Reading into things too much completed. Uh, witchcraft symbology. Oh, yeah, because there's a ton of these books elsewhere. Having mystic branches all over the world, but random waiting around won't do you much good. The symbology book will teach you how to wield the branch effectively and with style. Did I mention how fun it is to use spells on your friends? Uh oh. Oh god, he's gained he's gaining power. I don't like this. I completed loads of quests. So there's a symbology book somewhere in the A system, I suppose, which actually uh, tells you what to do with that stick. That might come in handy later. I want something else complete too. How the world changes. It's because we did some of we've made all the bits which it counts as. Oh, this is to charm a Find a familiar, you will need the ingredients listed below, and the pet you wish to bind to yourself needs to stand in the circle as you perform the right. Oh, you need an actual cat or something if you want to do that. Although, that's possibly not necessary for the... Uh... I think it's just a quest for getting the bits together. It's up to you if you want to actually do it and make get a pet, but <clears throat> it doesn't look like you actually need the pet to continue onward. No. Well, I think we need to do the pet anyway because of the rest of it. Hmm, where did you well hmm. we Teachers is now at ninety two percent. Yeah, no new leads in there though, we've got to still unlock elsewhere from that, I think. <clears throat> I think those books become available as you get the gubbins that the book talks yeah. about. Grows I reckon we can do next time. Critter snare slime. 
Let's, let's try that. Along in Parliament presiding. Yeah. Critter snare slime. Right. Snare. Critter snare witchery. Ah. Of course, any eye doesn't want to know, uh, obviously. So it's going to be in one of your witch tombs, probably. No, you're already... <laughs> oh, you're well away. How's that? Oh, right. oh wow. You, so you, well, you've, you've already made the snares somehow, and you just have to throw the right kind of creature at it, I suppose. Right, critter snares, done. That's all Last the ones for slimes. Killing task. Once you've got your... Hang on. To start with, you'll need two to four inch snared small slimes and an ocelot. Once you have these ready, place a spider's web above a block of water and place the ensnared slimes to the sides of the web. Then place four graspers at the corners of this square and in them place a charged attuned stone and three mutandis extremists. Then get the ocelot caught in the web and right click the web with your mutating sprig to turn the ensnared slimes into toads. Well, that seems really straightforward. It does rather. I think we should do it next time. <laughs> Righto. You might want to look at the prep for the other one then, since you've got your graspy snare things. Yeah, the other one looks a bit harder. You need critter snare bat. Have we got bat eggs? Well, we had them, but we used them all up. Mm. When we were looking, after, uh, looking for bat wool. Oh, right, yeah. Uh, okay, well, I can runically make new bat eggs. Um, with the Batonia stuff. Oh, we can probably use the fantastic A system to do it too. The new, new and improved automated runic altar. So it says we need two to four in snare bats and a wolf. It's basically the same sort of thing as the ocelot, except you end up with turning bats into owls. Oh. Right. <laughs> That's indeed how it works. I never was that strong on biology, but something seems wrong about that to me. How the world feels. So, yeah, that's my labyrinth quest. We could do that another time, I'm sure. How the world changes. What have we got in there? Crowdsourcing. That's, a, that's, that's recently opened and unlocked. It has indeed. What's that need? It needs happenstance oil and a quartz sphere. Seems there's a limit to how much power you can pour into the craft alone. To dabble in the more advanced arts, you're going to need to convince the other practiced witches you've encountered to form a coven with you. Uh -oh. With a familiar bound, coven witches will happily acknowledge you as their fellow practitioner. Ah, you do need a pet following you about, familiar. Otherwise the witches yeah. go mad and try and attack you. Presumably you become friendly with them if you've got a cat. However, they challenge, challenge you to complete a task with for them before they join your coven. Once you've completed the task and they join you, you'll need a way to have them help you with your rituals. First step towards that is making some happenstance oil in a kettle. I think we need to do the cat then. And I reckon once that's the case, the witches turn from hostile mobs into villager types, and you'll have to find some stuff to give to them. And then they'll join you, I reckon. Yeah. Sounds interesting. Yeah, so more witchery next time, I reckon. Right. Building a coven for a better future. Yeah. So join us next time where magic. I beat the guy guardian. Goodbye. <laughs>